from Montreal, Quebec, Canada. Welcome to Monday Night Raw. The road to WrestleMania is underway. The first stop will be at the Royal Rumble in a few weeks, and we still don't know who will earn the right to challenge Randy Orton for his WWE title. We're going to get our answer tonight, Cole. Stephanie McMahon has set up a match to decide the number one contender between John Cena and MVP. That is going to be an unbelievable matchup, King. Both men will pull out all the stops for the opportunity to face Orton at the Royal Rumble. Cena, this match tonight is my ticket to the top, baby. The people want to see MVP take home the WWE Championship. No offense, but if I have to whoop on you to get there, you can bet your last dollar it's happening. Well, look who's finally gone crazy. Man, they've been saying for years people shouldn't live underneath power lines. Well, I guess you're living proof. Oh, I know, I know. You got jokes. I'm serious, though. I'm going home as a number one contender tonight. But if through some miracle you come out on top, I ain't gonna hate. Just so long as at the end of this, Randy Orton gets that big mouth of his slap. You feel me? contender more times than I can count. I'm not sure if that's a plus or a minus as he battles a very determined MVP. He's looking to put his opponent away right here. Cena hits the five knuckle shuffle. This is it. Here he goes. Oh. Bomb by Cena. We're underway. Both hooking the leg. One, two, three. Cena did it. Cena gets the win. With an impressive win over a very game MVP, John Cena is number one contender for the WWE Championship. And if you're Randy Orton, that's probably not the news you wanted to hear. It certainly isn't, King. Those two have had some epic matches, and it looks like Royal Rumble is the site of another one. Can John Cena once again rightfully call himself the champ at the Royal Rumble? John Cena. That was some war we had last week. Now I ain't mad that you won, because MVP looks good even when he loses. That was one hell of a match, MVP. Now that you're the number one contender, you can bet Orton has some things up his sleeve. Wouldn't mind helping you against him and his cronies? Come track me down. I have a plan to initiate a kind of preemptive strike. Sounds good. I'll swing by in a bit.
Raw is live from Boston, Massachusetts. I'm Michael Cole, along with Jerry the King Lawler. And for WWE Champion Randy Orton, life has gotten a little more complicated. Well, with John Cena as the number one contender by virtue of his victory over MVP last week, the Viper has problems. In just one week, the two will square off at Royal Rumble for the WWE Championship. Well, look who finally showed up, Ted. John, number one contender, Cena. The way I look at it, Cena, beating a chump like MVP doesn't give you the right to take on an icon like Randy Orton. The way I look at it, your time is through. Or at least it will be when we're done with you. The only thing you're gonna be number one contender for is early retirement. I guess my evite to this party ended up in my junk folder. Think I'll join anyway. One daddy's boy down, one more to go.
Go run home crying to your first generation superstar daddies. This isn't over, Cena. You're never going to make it to the Royal Rumble. Well, you better come with more than that next time, pal. Randy didn't wait long before he started lobbing grenades, did he? And like usual, his plan didn't work out as he hoped. But he'll try again. And we'll beat him back again. Because you're going to stomp Orton at the Royal Rumble. If that means I gotta be your guardian angel until the Rumble, well, I can handle that. Raw is live for the Big Apple, and King, I'm anxious to see what's going to happen after the events that took place last week in Boston. Randy Orton seems hell-bent on eliminating any and all opposition to his WWE Championship reign. That's all speculation, Cole. We don't know Orton was behind it. You said yourself that Randy Orton was the mastermind, King. Well, I take it back. If he's not eliminating any and all opposition, I'm going to be sure not to oppose him. I've been accused of it a time or two. I just had Randy in my office telling me that you and MVP beat him up last week. What are you gonna do, ground me? So it's true. Well, since you and MVP enjoy ganging up on people so much, tonight you're getting a taste of your own medicine. The two of you are facing Legacy in a two-on-three handicap match. Look, Stephanie, you put whoever you want in there with Orton. I got something for him. And here's what I got for you. Ready for a little payback? After you. What the hell are you doing in here? Do I detect the hint of fear in your voice, Randy? Not so bad without your boys around, are you? I have no idea what you're talking about. If you're gonna send your boys to someone's locker room to beat someone up, better make sure they do the job. And if you wanna not get caught, then don't use the same two guys you've been rolling with for years. Sounded like a good idea, though. Two guys busting in, beating a lesson into somebody? Mind if I copy you? You can't just barge in here and threaten. A threat is nothing but words. We prefer actions. We'll see you later tonight, Randy. You need to leave, Cena. Or do I need to have you stripped of the number one contender spot? I don't know if one ring can handle all this animosity. Even the popcorn vendor is heading for the heels. He wants no part of this collision. Hey! Oh, look at this! DDT! Watch it! Uh. 
And John Cena's in complete control. Cena with momentum early on. Look at him unloading with the Dez press. Cena looking for something big. A belly-to-belly -belly suplex. John Cena in firm control now. He's taking a beating. It's a good thing he has two partners to tag out to, provided he can reach Legacy's corner. And he goes flying down to the concrete. Oh, what a powerbomb by Cena. Two! Look at this! Ah! Three! How about another one? Five knuckles shuffle. Oh man! Targeting the ribs and the lower back. That just takes all of the power out of him. Oh, jeez! Oh, He's knocked into next week! Oh, no! Trying to get under his opponent's skin with this one. I'm surprised Orton's been tagged into this match. Are you calling Randy Orton a coward, Michael? I wouldn't dream of it, King. How sudden was that? Ah, look at this! I don't know what's gonna happen here! Cena's feeling it again! You can't see me! going to feel that one for a while. I think that was as much personal as it was trying to earn the victory. Watch out here. Randy Orton, a victim of his own dirty deeds. And there's the elbow by MVP. After all of these shots to the head, I've got a feeling that Soup's going to be on his diet for the foreseeable future. Break! A scintillating maneuver. Oh, no! Man, his head just bounced off the floor there. There's the cover! Can he One, do it? Two, two! Three! Three! He did it! MVP wins! WWE's toughest factions ever, and these two came out on top. My crown is off to Cena and MVP. That was no small feat. It seems they have Orton's number, but knowing Randy, it's only a matter of time before he has his revenge. How will the Viper regroup? Stephanie, you need to control those two criminals. Oh, Randy. 
What are you talking about? Cena and MVP. They're running around, threatening me, trying to ambush me. They probably have traps set everywhere. You're a big boy. What do you want me to do about it? This is an unsafe work environment. I'm WWE Champion. There are threats against my life. I need round-the-clock security. As a businesswoman, you can't leave your biggest investment unprotected. Can you? I can, and I will. So far, Cena has done nothing to warrant my intervention. And until he does, you're facing him at the Royal Rumble. Now, if that's all... Fine. You obviously have some bias preventing you from acting sensibly. I'll go above your head on this one if I have to, Stephanie. Welcome to Monday Night Raw, live from Roanoke. Last week, WWE Champion Randy Orton ran into a roadblock in the form of John Cena and MVP. Tonight, things aren't much better. That's right, Michael. He'll be taking on Triple H in our main event. As for our number one contender, John Cena, we're not sure what tonight holds for him. Cena seems to be on GM Stephanie McMahon's bad side, so anything could happen. I got this sneaking suspicion. Orton's been around to fill your head with fables and fairy tales. You two are making my job a lot more difficult, and I'm getting a little tired of this. And what's your plan to deal with this, might I ask? Business as usual. I have so much... Look, I don't have time to talk. Just pick your opponent tonight from the list of superstars without scheduled matches. I'll look at the menu. Sure. Hello? Yes, I understand. Mm hmm Yes. Stay back, Cena. Take one more step toward me and I'll have you thrown in jail. So testy. Seems like all these schemes are wearing on your nerves, Randy. You want schemes? Ask MVP. That guy will stab you in the back in a heartbeat. Why is he such a friend all of a sudden? MVP doesn't have it in him to do that. Not anymore. Then there's The Miz. I hear he's been looking to jump you. See, what you're doing right now is deflecting. Besides, The Miz? I ain't worried about him. I've beaten him more times than I can count. If you say so, Cena. John Cena is taking on Dolph Ziggler, the opponent he handpicked tonight. Did he make the right choice, Ken? He may not be seven feet tall, but Ziggler is no pushover. Cena better bring everything he's got if he hopes to leave Roanoke with a win. Yow! Look at this! I 
think it's safe to say everyone in the WWE Universe knows Dolph Ziggler's name. Ever since his first televised match against Batista, he's been nothing short of impressive. Whether he's on Cena's level or not, we'll soon find out. Oh, no! He's looking to put his opponent away right here! Bomb by Cena. John Cena is rolling now against Ziggler. John Cena poised with the attitude adjustment. He thinks he has it. One, two, three. Cena wins. Cena wins. Dolph Ziggler got in the ring with a wild beast tonight, and his name is John Cena. Well, we thought Orton Zanix may have distracted the number one contender, but he looked razor sharp against a tough opponent tonight. I'm sure Randy Orton was watching this match from the locker room. He'd better be focused on his own match tonight, Michael. However, it'll be Cena and Orton for the WWE Championship in only six days at the Royal Rumble. In case you forgot a fellow. Ted and Cody, why am I not surprised to see you here? Whoa, put the safety on, loose cannon. We're not here to fight. Yeah, th there's no need to get violent. We're just here to let you know that there's been a change of plans. Not as far as I know. The plan is, was, and will be this. I plan on dumping Orton on his head and walking out the WWE Champion. Well, that's going to be pretty hard when you hear the news, Lunatic. Maybe you better go speak to Stefan. After you calm down, madman. The Royal Rumble has finally arrived here in our nation's capital. Tonight, 30 men get a dream opportunity. Win the Royal Rumble match, and a title shot is yours at WrestleMania. In addition, Michael, we're finally going to see the long-awaited one-on-one showdown between John Cena and Randy Orton for the WWE Championship. These two have never gotten along, but I think their rivalry is worse now than ever before. Keep with walking, John Cena. You will not attack Orton tonight. What's all this? We got orders not to let you anywhere near the WWE Champion. Well, you're gonna have trouble following these orders when I'm pinning him in that ring tonight. You have problem? Talk to GM. Don't talk to us anymore. You have some explaining to do, Stephanie. Calm down, Cena. Look, Orton went over my head. After that alleged assault, Randy got a restraining order against you and MVP. There's nothing I can do. A restraining order? Now, how is that gonna work? Check your calendar. My foot has an appointment with his cranium tonight. Not anymore, it doesn't. Your title shot is off. It's out of my hands. These two are here to make sure you don't try anything as you exit the arena. Please vacate the arena calmly, okay? Are you starting to believe Orton's lies? You think I'm some kind of maniac? Well, I'm not. I'll leave quietly. 
but this ain't over. Look, Cena, you can't beat Randy. He's just too smart. And he asked us to leave you this reminder. You didn't want to live without competition, yes? Now you're in for some pain, Cena. Kingston has the champion hurt. He may have come in as a last minute replacement, but he could leave a champion. Oh no, Cody Rhodes has sent Kofi crashing to the arena floor. It's a dirty tactic, but this is a no disqualification match. That's just uncalled for. How can Kofi survive against this onslaught? That fight for Randy Orton has all the angles covered. your winner and
Still, WWE Champion, Randy Orton. This is a disgrace. Kobe and Orton really did this. Again, I'm not advocating his actions, but you have to expect those kind of things when you face Randy Orton. But how long will he have to endure this tyrannical reign as WWE Champion King? At least we have something else to look forward to. The Royal Rumble match is next. MVP has won the Royal Rumble. He's going to WrestleMania to take on the champion of his choosing. What a camp to a wild night, Michael. This is the craziest Royal Rumble I can remember. And what happened to John Cena? The number one contender has a restraining order against him. Cena got robbed, but he may be the one going to jail if he gets too close to Randy Orton. MVP is going to WrestleMania. Randy Orton looks more dominant than ever. Can he be stopped? And it's me, it will never be a secret. I'm coming! Nobody can stop me, nobody can hold me, nobody can control me. I'm coming! I'm here to do my thing, I'm here to bring the pain, I'm never ever gonna change. I'm coming! Nobody.